Good morning, Georgia. Thanks for listening to Radio Station 106.5. We've got some great guests here today to talk about domestic violence. We have two special ladies from Georgia's countryside, Celia and Sophia. Welcome. Sophia, you're Celia's daughter-in-law, correct? Yes, ma'am. Celia? Hi. Celia, would you mind speaking up a bit? Oh, hi. So, Celia, what kind of domestic violence have you been exposed to? What? Domestic violence? Hey, my husband might hear this. I have to go. This is not good. I beg you, Celia, explain. Well, I don't really know. I mean, yeah, I get beat. I don't really know why. I work on the field all day and take good care of the children. I come home and he beat me for no reason. Oh, I see. So you show no resistance? Yeah, basically. Well, he be my husband. I have to be listening to him. But if you didn't do anything wrong, why do you take the abuse? Well, I don't know. I told you. He my husband. Anything that he does that aggravates you? Nah, I mean, he has another woman, Suge Avery. But I don't mind. What? So you're his wife, but he has another woman? Yeah. And you're okay with this? Well, he is the daddy in the family, and a dad can do whatever he wants. I take care of that woman too. I mean, she beautiful. She a great singer. Silly, that ain't right. Taking care of a woman you man obviously has a thing for, that ain't right. Sophia, so how about you? Domestic violence in your household? Yeah, there sure is. My husband Harpo he keeps trying to beat me, but uh, I don't take that. I hit back and make him wish he never hit me in the first place. He be the one with bruises. Oh, really? So you fight back? Yeah. Why does your husband want to beat you? I don't know. Probably because he wants to be like his daddy trying to beat up Seely. Well, it ain't gonna work on me, Harpo. But do you respect him? Yeah, I work hard and I'd be nice to him if that's what you mean. I fight only if he fight. Are you dependent on your husband? No, not at all. I do whatever I want. I go to my sister for a year. He don't say anything. Uh, I see. So you've got a lot more freedom there, Sophia. I notice you two have a very different ways in handling domestic violence. Mm-hmm. I guess so. So, Sophia, what would be your advice to Celie? Hmm. What a start. I guess, Celie, you need to be more confident. You need to stand up for yourself. You need to be brave. You need to be strong. You need to find courage. And if I were you, I would fight back if Mr. beat me. Whatever he doing to you is not right. Don't think like a helpless little girl that has no choice. You're a human being too, aren't you? You have that choice, so just stand up for yourself. I know you hiding your feelings. I know you hurt downside. But if you do what I say, your life will be so much better. I don't know where to find that. Find what, Celie? Find courage? I, I just don't know how. Alrighty, we're out of time here, ladies. Thanks for this interview. Now, back to our juke joint music. Shug Avery's new hit, You've Got a Friend in Me, coming up. Yeah, swing it.